for a few pairs of pity pants. Oh, well, I'm sorry, Prudy Pingleton. There were some extra charges. Some of your personal stains required pounding on. I'm home. Four o'clock. Guess I don't need to ask God's attention again. Tracy Turnblad, mind your manners, say hello to our guest. Hello, Mrs. Pingleton. And you, Penny. Hello, Mrs. Pingleton. Penny, mother. Teenagers. They just love watching that corny. Delinquents. It ain't right dancing to colored music. <laughs> Don't be silly. It ain't colored. The TV's black and white. Nice white kids who like to lead the way. And once a month we have our Negro day. And I'm the man that keeps it spinning around. With the corny cons with the latest grapes. Come on, help some more sound. So every afternoon we drop everything. Money, money, oh, money, money. Who needs to read and write when you can dance and sing? Yeah. Money, money, oh, money, money. Forget about your algebra and your calculus. You can always do your homework on the morning bus. Don't need a cap or a gown. They're the nicest kids in town. Shaking as you lie in bed. Money, money, oh, money, money. And the bass and drums are pounding in your head. Money, money, oh, money, money. Who cares about sleep when you can snooze from school? They'll never get to college, but they sure look cool. Don't need a cap for a gown, they're the nicest kids in town. Ah, 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 ah. Nice, ah, nice. Ah, ah, ah. Sound. And that was our newest dance for the week, the stricken chicken. We'll be right back. And we're off for natural commercial, Brenda. What is this? 
Here's a pad. Tammy. Link. Stop hogging the camera. Not all of us yet. Amber, hog the camera. Yes, mother. And you, Corny? None of that Detroit sound today? Do you have something against Pony Francis? Kids are just over the moon and rubber for bulls, Farmer. They can't get enough. They're kids. You need to steer them in the white direction, if you know what I mean. Amber, I've got something for you. You know, I figured since, uh, We've been going sort of uh, steadily. Uh, we might as well make it official. Link, your council member ring, and it matches my hair exactly. Ah, ah, ah. Keep your personal eyes for the camera. I'm going back in five, four, three, two, one. And now, guys and kids, don't forget our newest primetime spectacular will be coming up on June 6th. We will be live at Baltimore's brand new inventory and broadcasting nationwide. Talent scouts will be on hand from all major recording labels, and sponsoring the event will be none other than our very own Ultra Club Chesper. So, let's give a big fawning Baltimore salute to the president of Ultra Club Chesper, Mr. Harry Maness Spritzer. Ultra Clutch is happy to bring you fine youngsters to national attention. A oh, big break! And also later in the special, we'll be crowning Miss Teenage Hairspray 1962. My big break! Ooh, well, isn't she a lovely slim girl? I guess Amber's pretty, but she can't dance. Plastic little spastic. Oh no! I'm gonna kill myself! Look! She's wearing Link's council ring. Hey gang, don't forget to watch Mum and Me next Thursday on Mother Daughter Day. And don't forget, I want to be your Miss Teenage Hairspray. Remember, a vote from you for me is a vote for me. What an unexpected ad Amber. But speaking of expecting the unexpected, our very own fun-loving, freewheeling Brenda will be taking a leave of absence from the show. How long will you be gone? Nine months. <laughs> so it seems we'll be having an opening for the girl on the show. Want to be one of the nicest kids in town? Cut school short tomorrow and head down to station WZZT to audition. Oh my god, it's a dream of a lifetime! I have to go audition! Oh my god, it's a dream of a lifetime! I have to go watch your audition! Oh, no, 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 no. There'll be enough of that for one day. No one is auditioning for anything. There'll be no cutting school in this house. Oh, and Mrs. Turnblad! Penny, go tell your mother she wants you. She does? Oh, I better go. Goodbye, Mrs. Turnblad. Goodbye, Tracy! Whoa, rush our traffic. Hiya, ladies. Just got a new shipment of exploding bubblegum, so business downstairs is booming. How am I too, funny honeys? Oh, stop it, Wilbur. You're the funny one. Daddy, tomorrow I'm auditioning to dance on a TV show. Oh, no, 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 no. You're going to do a lot more than that to get around me, young lady. I want to tell you about that hair. Rat it up like a teenage Jezebel. Mother, you are so 50s. Even our first lady, Jackie B. Kennedy, wraps her hair. Well, yeah, well, you ain't no first lady. She's a hair hopper. That's what got to put into tension again. Wilbur, talk to her. Girls like Tracy, people like us, you know what I mean? They don't put us on TV except to be laughed at. Tracy, is this really what you want? It's my dream, Daddy. Then go for it, babe. This is America. You got to think big to be big. Being big is not the problem, Wilbur. When I was your age, my parents begged me to run away with the circus. But I said, no, that's what you want. I have dreams of my own. I dreamt of opening a chain of joke shops worldwide. Okay, yeah, I still only got one. But someday, if I can manage to somehow stop the air from leaking out of my sofa-sized whoopee cushion, I'll make a noise heard all around the world. <laughs> <laughs> you go follow your dream, babe. I'm grabbing a, an orange crush and heading back downstairs to the hardy har hut. I've got a dream. I love it. We are not helping, Wilbur. Oh, thanks, Daddy. Oh, no, no. Where do you think you're going, young lady? I've got a whole pile of clothes to fold, and my diet pill's starting to wear off. But, Mama, I want to be famous. You want to be famous? Learn how to get blood out of a car upholstery. Now that's a skill you can take to the bank. You don't think I had dreams? I was going to make all my own clothes. I was going to be the biggest thing in Brazil's. But no, you deal with what life gives you. So start folding. But mom, I was only watching the corny show over at Tracy's. Didn't I forbid you from listening to race music? Oh, if the police ever locates your father, he'll punish you good. But don't 
dancing was atrocious, Amber. I'm willing to lie, cheat, and steal to get you that Miss Teenage Hairspray crown. Do you need to work with me? And let me have that sit. Stop! That is no way to treat clean clothes. One day, you'll own Edna's Occidental Laundry. Will you be ready? I hope not. Don't contradict me. Don't disobey me. Don't even think about going to that audition. Please! No! no. Mother! Stop! Stop telling me what to do. Don't! Don't, Don't treat me like a child up to No! no. I don't know how Rock Hudson stands it. Ah! Well, excuse me, little darling. I hope I didn't dent your do. I can hear the bell. Tracy, are you all right? 
Don't you hear them chime? Tracy, I don't hear anything. Can't you feel my heartbeat keeping perfect and all because he touched me, he looked at me and stared, yes he bumped me, my heart was unprepared when he tapped me and knocked me off my feet. One little touch, now my life's complete Cause when he bumped me, love put me in a fix Yes, it hit me, just like a ton of bricks Now my heart bursts and I know what life's about One little touch and love's not me out And I can hear the bells, my ears are ringing I can hear the bells, something but he says that a girl who looks like me can win his love well just wait and see cuz I can hear the bells just hear them chiming I can hear the bells my temperature's climbing I can't contain my joy cuz I finally found the boy I've been missing listen I can hear the bells Because round three When we kiss inside his car Won't go all the way But I'll go pretty far Round four He'll ask me for my hand And then round five We'll book the wedding band So by round six Amber, much to your surprise This heavyweight champion Takes the prize And I can hear the bell Just think I can hear the bells, the bridesmaids are singing, everybody won't, but a guy who's such a gem, won't look my way while the laugh's on them, cause I can hear the bells, my father will smile, I can hear the bells, as he walks me down the aisle, my mother starts to cry, but I can't see cause Link and I are French kids. audition. Isn't that just too cool? Wait, can I start over? I'm a little bit nervous. I promise I'll calm down as soon as I'm finished having a heart attack. Anyway, I brought my own 45, so if you just put them on, I'll show you my stuff. Mm, haven't you shown us enough? All right, people. Front step, cha-cha-cha. Back step, cha-cha-cha. Front step, cha-cha-cha. Oh my God, how times have changed. Girls are the blind or completely deranged The time seems to hold And I was misfold Oh, craps You laugh, but life a test Don't do this, don't do that Remember, mother knows best But the crown's in the vault I'm 
I was Miss Baltimore Crabs. Those poor runner-ups might still hold some grudges. They padded their caps. I screwed the judges of broad today when they played their spin and their dance. <laughs> Not a chance, so I hit the stage, but tons of blaze, bolting, I even preparing to place, but that triple somersault, how I can just bolt a mole crabs. Proceed. Are you scared we're on live? No, I'm sure I can cope. Well, this show isn't broadcasted in Cinemascope. No, 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 dessert. I was Miss Baltimore. Oh, you're bold. If I was Miss Baltimore Crabs. A tycoon, I went so cuddly and funny. The old fart dropped dead, left tons of money. So I bought the station so all of the nations could see. Baby Amber and me. Do you dance like you dress? Well, there's no need to be cool. Would you swim in an integrated pool? I sure would. I'm all for integration. It's a new frontier. Most impressions can be tough. When I saw you, I knew it. if your size weren't enough, your last answer is good. And so, my dear, so short and stout, you'll never be in, so we're kicking you out with your form and your face. Oh, it isn't your fault. You're just down with the case of Miss Baltimore Crash. Black. You can both exalt because I'm a sports mall. Once again, your monumental hair don't has seriously obstructed everyone else's view of the blackboard. As principal of Patterson Park High, I condemn you to three more days of detention. Detention? Is there no pity for a teen just trying to fit in? Well, maybe you wouldn't try so hard. Excuse me, you get detention just about every time that I do, and I never see you complain. Oh, but I do. This is my way of complaining. You gotta use them blues, brother. You gotta use them or lose them. A man can die on a doubt of detention, so long as you don't stop in my tunes. Here's something signified to say. Hello, my name is Seaweed J. Stubbs. What's yours, little darling? That's unbelievable. Can I do that? I don't know. Can you? Hello, my name is Trey C. Turn Lad. Woo -wee. Not bad for a white girl. Ain't no black and white in here. Detention is a rainbow experience. What's that step? Oh, this? I call it paid in place after midnight. Use your trick, um, the opposite sex. <laughs> oh, feel us, girl, you got it going. Yeah, this program's joining you already in progress. Hey, I just realized where I've seen you before. I've seen you dance on Negro Day. Of course you do. It's my mom's show, homie. Your mom is Motormouth Maybell the DJ? Yes. That makes you like royalty. Negro Day's the best. I wish every day were Negro Day. <laughs> well, at our house, it is. <laughs> 
Courtney Collins is hosting the sophomore hawk tomorrow night. If he saw me dance like this with you, he'd surely put me on the show. So how you feel about the tension now? I'm a bad, bad girl who needs to be punished. Oh yeah! <laughs> Smiling, laughing, dancing in detention. Tracy Turnblad, you can give up all hopes of college. I'm putting you in a special ed with the rest of these characters. Special ed? What do they do there? We do musicals. Hey there, sophomores and sophomores at heart. I am honored to be your guest DJ at PPHS. So, with no further ado, -do, let's do do some dance. Woo! Now it's the hottest thing in and around and was born right here in Baltimore. What's it called, kids? Ladies first. Where do you first see it? The, the Corny Collins Show. That's right. Let's dance. Woo! Hey, look, it's Ladies Choice, my favorite. You keep an eye out for Corny. This could be a big break. Then you keep your eyes on me. Woo! You little girl with the cash to burn. Well, I'm telling something you won't return. Hey, little girl, take me off the shelf. This is how damn fun playing with yourself. Once you browse through the whole selection, shake those hips in my direction. Bring it back in, evidence. Take me home and then unwrap me. Shop around my little doll I got to be. The lady's choice. The lady's choice. Hey, little girl looking for a sale And just drive this American mail It's gonna take cash to fill my tank So let's crack open your piggy bank Hey, little girl, go in on shopping I got something trying to stop it Prettiest package ever this Take me home and then on around me Shop around me, little darling, I got to be Ladies, joy Ladies choice. Woo! How come we always have to dance with that? I don't know if it's them and it's us, just the way it is. Hey little girl, I'm any free. I don't come cheap, but kiss come free. I'm close for inspection, I'm sure that you will agree. Ladies choice. I don't come deep, but the kids come free. I'm close to respect, and I'm sure that you will agree. I'm the lady's choice. The lady's choice. I'm the lady's choice. It's the lady's choice, choice, choice. I'm the lady's choice. wash this ear again. <laughs> You're funny and you got some pretty nice moves. Thank you. My friend Seaweed taught them to me. Oh, well, you can tell uh, your friend Seaweed that uh, he's got some extra special moves and that you look extra fine doing them. Thank you. Hi, Corny. Hey there, Cupcake. What's your name? Hi, I'm Tracy Turnblad. Oh, yeah? And what else do you have hiding underneath those big buster browns? Well, here's a little something I picked up in detention. It's called the Peyton Place After Midnight. All I use right. it to attract the opposite sex. Hey, check it out, everybody! Yeah, yeah JC! <laughs> that girl is the screen to win! Hey 
every day? That chubby communist girl and that kiss. I assure you, controversy is not what Ultra Clutch wishes to promote. Some girls and Negroes buy hairspray tubes this Christmas. Mrs. Von Dussel, how do you plan to handle this? Um, I plan to stop firing her. What? <laughs> Wait. You cannot fire Corny Collins from the Corny Collins show. Why not? Do it all the time on glasses. Bringing trees on the show was just the beginning. I have new ideas for updating the show. I'm getting one of my sick headaches. Is there a place where I can lie down? To the bed in my office. So, you have any ideas? And going behind my back to put on this non talent pommy is one of them. Damn right, Velma. It's time we put the kids on the show who look like the kids who watch the show. Not while I'm producing it. I was thinking I might just change that. Are you threatening me, Courtney? You know me, Velma. I can always take the show to Channel 11 now. Yes, I'm sure Tracy appreciates your vote for Miss Teenage Hairspray. Oh, and I'm sure she loves you too, whoever you are. <laughs> Goodbye. Crazy. Hello? What am I wearing? Scuffies, support hose, and a house coat. What are you wearing? Hello? Hello? Did you see me, Mom? Did you see me? Oh, of course I did. It was on television. I had to. The phone's been ringing like we were a telethon. To think the food in my womb is now a beloved TV icon. Are you mad? Mad? How could I be mad? You are famous, Tracy. If you had told me you'd get on the show, I would never have said you couldn't. But sit. Tell me, is fame everything you thought it would be? Are you happy, honey? I am, Mama. And I think I'm in love. There it goes again. Hello? Yes, this is Tracy Turnblad. Hello, Mr. Pinky. Mr. Pinky? The Mr. Pinky? As in Mr. Pinky's hefty hideaway? Quality clothes for Quantity Gals? That Mr. Pinky? You want me to be your new spokesgirl in fashion effigy? Well, I'm flattered, but I'm afraid all business must go through my agent. We'll be right over. Agent? I don't know any agents. Mama, put that thing down. I'm taking my new agent to hefty hideaways and then for a night on the town. Who, me? Really, Tracy Turnblad, fame has gone to your head and left you wacky. You need a top-shelf professional. Who handled the Gabor sisters? Well, who didn't? Ma, it's a great big world out there I know nothing about. And when things get rough, a girl needs her mother. Hun, I'll be here by your side if that's what you want. And together we will claw our way to the top. But can't we do it over the phone, Tracy? I haven't left this house in ten years. Well, then isn't it time you did? Oh, no. You have your father meet with him. The neighbors haven't seen me since I was a size 10. Please don't make me do it, Tracy. Mom, it's changing out there. You'll like him. People who are different, their time is coming. Hey, mama, hey, mama, look around. Everybody's moving to a brand new sound. Hey, mama, hey, mama, follow me. I know something's in you that you want to set free So let go, go, go of the past now Say hello to the love in your heart Yes, I know that the world's been in fast now But you gotta get yourself a brand new start Hey mama, welcome to the 60s Oh, 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 oh. Oh, 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 hey, mama. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, mama, hey, mama, have some fun. I've been left this house since 1951. Hey, mama, hey, mama, take a chance. Oh, Tracy, it's been years since someone asked me to dance. So let go, go, go to the past now. Say hello to the light in your eyes. You to know that the world's made it fast now, but you gotta run your way. Oh, 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 hey, mama. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, 
Jenny don't ask why they lost. Eat him up, girls. Hello, Mr. Pinky, I'm Tracy. There's my shiny star. Television doesn't do you justice. Oh, Mr. Pinky, you picked a lovely girl to put the plus in your plus sizes. Tracy, this can't be your agent. She must be your gorgeous big sister. <laughs> I'm not her gorgeous big sister. I'm 54 double D. Triple E, baby. I fit the mother load. Step inside and let's make a deal. Cause it's time for a star who looks just like you It's so nice to meet you Nice to meet you, Tracy Let's measure you up Turn on Hey Tracy, hey baby, look at me. I'm the cutest chicky that you ever did see. Hey Tracy, hey baby, look at us. Where is there a teen that's half as fabulous? I let go, go, go of the past now. Said hello to this red covered rock. Ah, I guess I know that the world's been in fast now. From Mr. Pinky, Pinky Dan and Shepherd's side, your mom is welcome to 16. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, your mama's talking to me in the 60s. Oh, 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 oh. Go, mama, go, go, go. to be. Isn't it the dreamiest? It's called the Tracy. Everyone, if anyone has one, gather around students and race yourself for scattered dodgeball. Kathy Schmidt told me she heard Tracy Turnblad in the back of the car with two guys at once playing tonsil hockey in the nude. <gasps> is it true they put in special ed? Tracy Turnblad is a tramp and she's retarded. She's fast and slow at the same time. <laughs> Link Larkin, how could you kiss that beehive buffalo on the air? That didn't mean anything, Amber. It was just a cool way to end the song. Here they come, special ed. <laughs> that ain't cool, <laughs> Special ed. Oh, Link, if fate forces you to throw the ball at me today, seal it with a kiss. You got a prayer for me too? This game can get really brutal. What is Seattle Dodgeball anyway? Well, it's kind of like a protest rally. Seems like a good idea until the cops show up, then you gotta scatter and dodge. Tracy, I'm so sorry about your special edness, but I think it's a testament to the record-breaking extremes your hair has reached. I'm so jealous. <laughs> Who's this? Oh, Seaweed, this is my best friend, Penny Lou Pingleton. Oh yeah, I've seen you at the concession stand getting your lollipops. <laughs> I do two a day. All that chewing must make the muscles in your mouth mighty strong. <laughs> oh no, just average. <laughs> well, 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 if it isn't Tracy Tugboat, you finally found a title you could win. Miss Special Ed. Amber Von Tussle, you have acne of the soul. 
Students, commence. Dodge this thunder thighs. You throw like a girl. Hey, no fair, throwing at the head. That's right, go for his nuts. <laughs> hey, guys, 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 take it easy. Come on, man, this isn't World War III. Says you, take this trampy tunnel on. <laughs> Aww, poor Tracy. So tragic, I forgot to cry. Are you coming, Link? Amber, that wasn't necessary. Link, are you coming? In a minute. I'll be waiting under the bleachers. Uh oh! Tracy! Are you dead? I better go get the school nurse. I'll come with you! Hey, Trace. Are you okay? That ball hit you pretty hard, huh? Gee, you sure are beautiful when you're unconscious. Where am I? Link? Oh, you better? For a second I thought it was Teen Angel time. Wherever I am, please do not change the channel. Tracy! <laughs> you got a funny way of putting things. I like that. Tracy, the nurse is out sick, but look what seaweed found. Uh, I got band-aids, q-tips, oh, and a rubber. Oh. I guess this one's mine. He's so nurturing. <laughs> oh, Seaweed, this is my friend Link. How you doing, ma'am? What's up? How are you doing? How do you think I'm doing? I just got creamed in front of the entire school. Hey, I know what'll make you feel better. Hey, Trace, my mom's pitching a patter party at a record shop up at Ruth Avenue. Wanna come uh, check it out? Um, I do feel uh, not good. <coughs> hey, also come check it out? Oh, yeah, you showed him man. I've never been to North Avenue. Safe up there for people like us? Yeah, don't worry, you cool, cracker boy. Imagine getting invited places by colored people. I feel so hip. I'm glad you do, cause uh, not everyone does. I can see what people look at me and only see the color of my face. And then there's those who try to help but knows, but always have to put me in my place. But I won't ask you to be colorblind, cause if you pick the fruit, then go you sure to find. The black is the berry, the sweet is the juice I have to say it is so, but darling, what's the use? The darker the chocolate, the richer the taste And that's the reason Now run and tell that Run and tell that Now won't you run and tell that Run and tell that I can't see why people disagree It's time I tell them what I know is true and if you come and see the world I'm from, I bet your heart is gonna feel it too. Yeah, I could lie, but baby, let's be bold. Vanilla can be nice, but if the truth be told, the black is the berry, the sweet is the juice. I can say it is so, but darling, what's the use? The dark is the chocolate, the richer the taste, and that's a attack. Now run and tell that. Run and tell that. Now won't you run and tell that. Run and tell that. Oh, now run and tell that. Run and tell that. Now won't you run and tell that. Good for you, girl. You got on the show. Hey, yeah, this is my sister, Lil Inez. Sure, I saw you at the audition. Well, you're the only one who did, because they kicked me out. I'm the youngest black guy. Sure, girl. I'm tired of covering up all of my pride. So give me a vibe on the black hand side. Got a new way of moving, and I got my own voice. So how can I help but to shout and rejoice? Oh, The reason 
Well, it gon' be the kind of world where we all get our chance The time is now when we can show them how Just turn the music up and let's all dance But all things are equal when it comes to love Well, that ain't the case, cause the push comes to shove The passion is very, the sweeter the be Say it so, darling, what's the use? The darker the chocolate, the richer the taste And that's very sad Now run and tell that Run and tell that Now won't you run and tell that Run and tell that Oh, now run and tell that Run and tell that Now won't you run and tell that Oh, 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 wow Oh, 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 oh What else would you expect from Miss Mouth Mango? Mom, look, I brought the friends. Whoop de doo, what a coup! They have a sparkling to Lick Larkin. Always nice to see you, Miss Motormouth. I'm Penny Lou Pingleton, and I'm very pleased and um, scared to be here. Oh, you're welcome, kitten, to come sit in. This is just so afrotastic. Can I say how glad I am to meet you, Miss Motormouth? My name's Tracy Turnblad. I'm Seaweed's friend. Is there? Oh, yes, indeedy. I've seen you, sweetie. All of Glow on Corny Show. Gee, thanks, but the only reason I'm on that show is because of your son. Yep. Why can't we all just dance on TV together? You think we haven't tried? We've pleaded, begged, and laughed. We pressured the mayor and petitioned the gov. And what we get? One, One day a month. Mm. That's enough talking, everybody. We came to dance. Let's play some music. Wow! I feel good. I'm trying to fit in. What are you doing? I waited for you under the bleachers through halfway through JB Trackney. And then I saw you getting on the North Avenue bus. So I followed you here in my brand new car. Well, we're having a blast. Come jump in. Ah! Appa, has anybody touched you? Y'all better hustle. Here's no tussle. I <laughs> saw you getting into your darling new car, so I followed you in mine. But I'm off. Are you brainwashing these children? They're only dancing. Yeah, we were only dancing. And you should have known that you're at the bottom of this. Ooh, there you are, Tracy. Wilbur, they're over here. Mama, what are you doing here? <laughs> oh, I had a sudden craving for KFC. So your father and I went to take out down the way. Hello, everyone. I'm Tracy's mother. Oh, so you're what spawned that? Excuse me? I guess you're the living proof that the watermelon doesn't fall far from the vine. Tracy, be a dear and hold mommy's chicken. All right, a party! Anyone up for chicken and waffles? If we get a little white people in here, it's gonna be a supper. <laughs> Come on, Amber. Let's go back to the right side of the truck. Come across us there. Are you coming, Link? Amber, you're being rude to these people. Come on, Amber. Link, come. Link, come. Amber, just go. Whatever happened to the bland, spineless boy I fell in love with? Mother, come! I don't care for them. Are all white people like that? No, just most. Well, I know a way we can start changing that. If people saw us all dance together, they'd realize we're not all that different. We all just want to have a good time. Are you saying you and Nick are willing to dance with us on Negro Day? That would be earth-shaking! No, we're not going to dance on Negro Day. You're going to crash White Day. White day is every day. You have to be more specific than that. Is tomorrow specific enough? Think. It's parent-child day. Miss Motormouth, you work for the station. They could never turn little Inez away. And once you two break the barrier, we'll all be free to dance on TV together. That thing is downright revolutionary, homie. Well, Sarah Sparks like Rosa Parks. Child, it ain't that easy. This ain't part cheesy. Why don't they call the cops? People could get hurt. Well, then we'll walk together. There's me, there's Link, and I'm sure we could get others. Without dancers, there's no show. What a decision! Your girl's got vision. We've always tried to teach her to do right. And to give correct change. <laughs> Trace, you can't do this. You're new to the council. You'll be blackballed and thrown off the show for sure. But that's why we're doing it together. Not me. You don't think segregation is wrong? Look, Trace. I like these people, but whether or not they're on TV is not going to get me a recording contract. That came out wrong. Listen, I've been singing, dancing, and smiling on the show for three years, waiting for it to lead to my break. 
You've got everything. Brains, talent, personality, me. I've got this one chance to get seen nationwide. Tomorrow night is everything I've worked for, and I can't just throw it away. Come on, I'm leaving, and you got it too. No, you should stay. It's what's right. Stay, Link. Stay. I'm sorry. But you and me, I was just starting to think. Yeah, me too, but it's getting kind of complicated. And there's still am. See you, little dog. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, Tracy. Oh, Mama, how could I think Link Larkin ever liked me? What are you talking about? You're a beautiful girl. Don't tease, Mama. I really liked him. I never felt like this before. I know. And I'm sure he likes you, too. Boys are not the brightest things. Just give him time. I'm sure he realizes he's crazy about you. You have to say that. You're my mother. I'm more than your mother. I'm a woman in love. And we know about these things. But Tracy, he could be right. Did you risk your career? I wouldn't even have a career if it weren't for seaweed. No, it's payback time. That's my girl. OK, so here's how we're going to work it. Everyone bring your mothers and fathers and meet around the corner from the station and make signs. Yeah, and put words on them. Miss <laughs> Monomo, you and little Inez will go in first. Me and my mama will be right behind you. Excuse me? They'll never be able to shove them out with us blocking the door. Oh, no. No one said anything about me being on TV. I'm sorry, but I cannot appear on television at my current weight. You cannot let your weight restrict your fate. Oh, but Miss Motormouth, I'm fat, and I would rather not be on TV for everyone to see. Uh -uh. Mr. Turnblad, do you mind that Mrs. Turnblad is an Apple American? Not at all, and I love her all the more. Yeah! Nothing to do me! You listen to me! <laughs> I will join your fight if I keep up the pace. And girls, I'll be right by your side if I can find some space. So you can hold your head up just as big as you please. You know they'll hear us knocking with two of these. Tomorrow, 
side by side, we'll show the world what's right. I guess I'll be touching up my roots tonight. And we'll be big, blonde, and beautiful. So face the fact, it's simply irrefutable. Can you hear that rumbling? It's a hunger to be free. It's time to finally taste equality! On Mother Daughter Day, we're thin as in, we're white as wool. Well, ladies, big is back. And as for black, it's beautiful. Yeah! Woo! The sizes follow me! Let's bust their chops! Someone call the cops. We're gonna dance away to victory! Stay away, this is Negro Day. Two, Two four, four, six, eight, TV's gotta integrate! Two, four, six, eight, TV's gotta integrate! We're Two, here to dance. We're here to stay. Big, blind, and beautiful, lead the way. No one's getting on TV today! up in the slammer, this dollhouse. All right, ladies, welcome to the big dollhouse. For those of you new to the penal system, I'm letting you know now that I don't stand for boozing, gambling, cussing, fighting, or any other sort of unladylike behavior. Think of me as a mother who eats her young, locked up with all these low-life women and horizontal stripes, and exactly slimming. Is there anyone here who could dry clean my blouse? Sorry, it's the maid's day off. Lady Justice, where have you gone? Oh, damn, I think I left the iron on. You see Link laughing? I could have killed the louse. Honey, delegate your life from the big dollhouse. No phone. No food. No men. I think I need a conjugal visit from my loving spouse. Exercise, ladies. Get in the trenches, you wenches. Ah, uh, yoo-hoo. Excuse me. My stomach is going sour. I haven't had food in over an hour. You just ate pizza, a bagel, and a mouse. There's no food left in the big dollhouse. Matron, I have to complain. Someone call my lawyer Lipsis and Strauss. You get out of this big dollhouse. Not fair. No food. No fun. And our fight has just begun. Because it's freedom flame that you like to douse. So we must break out of this dollhouse. You do the crime, you gotta do the time. Penny, I can't take all this waiting. I've lost my man and my hair's deflating. Well, I hate to grumble and grouse, but it is your fault we're in the big dollhouse. Oh, calm down, everyone. There's no need to shout. Don't you have an old man to bail you out? <laughs> her dad's a loser, a pervert, a louse. Well, it's just us girls in the big dollhouse. God, I'm too young to fry. I'm busting out. So am I. Lady Justice, you're up here because the big dollhouse ain't big enough for me. Or me. Recess is over, ladies. It's time to pay your debt to society. And remember, tipping is optional. Oh, to think I'd live to get a rap sheet. Oh, my mother would be so proud. Remember, your grandmother was a suffragette. That's right, Mrs. Von Tussle. You haven't heard the last of us. We'll march again, and this time to the beat of a whole new era. Bang your drums, Bonzo. No one cares, and don't get any cute ideas of showing up at that special. I'll have the inventorium surrounded by armed guards to make sure that you don't get within 100 miles of it. Game set and match. One tussle, Amber. One tussle, Valma. That's us. Ladies, you are free to go with the sincere apologies of the state of Maryland and the personal compliments of the governor himself. The governor? Sweet Shabby Mellet, we did it on and off in college. Now, if you... A couple white twins would excuse me. Got a national TV spectacular to produce. I was never here. This never happened. Oh, and Tracy, any messages for Link? Place it on my lips, and I'll make sure he gets it. So long, Baltimore Rons. Oh, I still don't care for them. I hear, Miss T. This old jail just got a whole lot nicer. You've got a visitor. Bail has been posted. I posted bail. Wilbur? How? Simple, really. I mortgaged the hardy Harhat. Oh, Daddy. But Wilbur, that place is your life. You two are my life. 
Bail for everyone. Bail for the house. You're all free to go. The two that gang are real good folks. They have the heart. They get the jokes. Hold it, sucker man. We're keeping that Rotan Brother Rouse on ice. But how? I paid for everyone. I even got a group discount. Tracy Turnblad is herewith and forthwith withheld without bail. She is to be moved to solitary confinement and to be held there until further notice by the governor's office. So there. The governor's office? Mrs. Von Tussle, manipulating our judicial system just to win a contest is so un-American. Don't make things worse for yourselves. Move out peacefully. I'm not going anywhere without my daughter. It's okay, Daddy. They can't keep me here forever. And besides, I've got a lot to think about. I might as well do it in solitary confinement. I'm counting to three, and then I'm re-arresting you for illegal trespass. Let's go. We can't do Tracy any good here. You touch one hair on my daughter's head, and I'll teach you a whole new meaning for split ends. Keep the faith, baby! They haven't heard the last from us! You're so lucky you're getting out of the algebra final! Yes, Mr. Pingy, I understand you have an empire to protect. Yes, I return the clothes. Oh, the petty pants too. Oh, but I scarcely wore them twice. Oh, yes, I understand. Okay. But Mr. Pinky, please realize that Tracy's just a little girl, and little girls make big mistakes. Else there wouldn't be any more little girls. Yes, I'm, it's a shame it had to end this way. Yes, Mr. Pinky. Goodbye. Oh, Wilbur, I think I'm going mental. I'm closing up the shop. Oh, my stomach's in knots. I bought a box of Malamars and they're still in the box. Calm down, sweetheart. You cannot calm down. There are nasal women who abandon their daughters after they get arrested for trying to integrate an after-school sock hop type television show. Yes, there are names. And Hallmark does not make cards for them. Don't worry about people calling you names. You know how many times I've been called crazy? But I just simply say, yeah, crazy. Crazy like a loon. And anyway, don't think we've abandoned Tracy. I've got what she needs right here. Stand back. Woo! <laughs> well, what do you think? Impressive. Doozy? But how's it going to help our Tracy? You'll be surprised. Oh, sure. You're a genius inventor saving the day. Tracy's a teen idol reshaping the world. And what am I? I had a dream too, you know. I was going to make all my own clothes until I went larger than the largest McCall's pattern. You were always good at it, Edna. Sure, and where's that gotten me? Twenty years on, I'm still washing and ironing everyone else's clothes. 
One day, Edna. No day, Wilbur. My day has come and gone. I'm like an old, worn-out pair of bobby socks and the elastic's all stretched. Nonsense, doll. You're as spry as a splinky. Whenever I'm next to you, it's like grabbing hold of a giant joy bus. Stars keep a changing, the world's rearranging, but hey, now your time is to me. Airlines are shorter, a beer costs a quarter, but time cannot take what comes free. You're like a stinky old cheese, babe. Just getting riper with age. You're like a fatal disease, babe. But there's no cure, so let this fever rage. Some folks can stand it, say time is a bandit. But I take the opposite view. Cause when I need a lift, time brings a gift. Another day with you. A twist or a waltz, it's all the same schmaltz with just a change in the scenery. You'll never be an old pal, that's that. Your time is to me. Oh, Wilbur, I love you. Fads keep a fading, your Castro's invading. But Wilbur, your time is to me. Hairdos are higher, mine feels like barbed wire. But you say I'm as cheap as can be. You're like a rare vintage ripple, a vintage they'll never forget. So pour me a teeny weeny triple, and we can toast the fact we ain't dead yet. I can't stop eating, your hair is receding, and soon there'll be nothing at all. So you'll wear a wig while I roast a pig. Hey, pass the Jared doll. Glenn Miller had class, the chubby checkers a gas, but they all pass eventually. You'll never be passe, hip hooray. You're timeless to me. Like a broken down Chevy All I need is a fresh coat of paint And Edna, you got me going hot and heavy You're fat in your old, but baby boring you ain't Some folks don't get it, but we never fret it Cause we know that time is our friend And it's plain to see that you're stuck with me until the bitter ends And we got a kid Who's blowing the lid Off the Turnblad family tree You'll always hit the spot, big shot You're timeless to me You'll always be to you Mon amour You're timeless to me You'll always be the string. Ring a ding ding. You're timeless to me. You're timeless to me. You're timeless to me. You're timeless.
Trace, where are you? It's me, Link. Link, over here. Shh, the guard's asleep. You look beautiful behind bars. It must be the low watt institutional lighting. Link, what are you doing here? Oh, Tracy, seeing you thrown in jail brought me to my senses. I thought I'd lose it when I thought I'd lost you. I couldn't eat, I couldn't sing, I couldn't even concentrate. You couldn't eat? No. So I went down to the station <clears throat> to tell Mrs. Von Tussel that I was done with the Miss Hairspray broadcast. You did? I didn't. When I got down to the station, I overheard Mrs. Von Tussel talking to Spritzer. Trace, it's Amber the talent scouts are coming to see. It had nothing to do with me. All this time, I thought Amber and I were a team. Turns out she and her mom were just using me to make her look popular. I feel like such an idiot. That makes two of us. I know a beluga like me isn't worthy of a groundbreaking extremist like you, but uh, it's a little scuffed <laughs> from Amber throwing it in my face when I told her I'd rather be with you. You did? I did. So would you consider wearing my ring? Would I? Would I? <laughs> to lose thee were to lose thyself. Some kid named Milton wrote that in the third floor boys' room. It's beautiful. I have a great life. Great parents, my own room, a stack of 45s, and a learner's permit good through August. Penny Lou Pingleton, you are absolutely, positively, permanently punished. This one is for being willful. This one is for being deceitful. This one is for being neglectful. And this one is for crying wee, wee, wee all the way home. Why is it that every time you tie your daughter up, the phone rings? Psst, Penny, what happened? Oh, seaweed, my mother's punishing me for going to jail without her permission. I've come to rescue my fair maiden from a tower. Oh, seaweed, you do care. I was so worried it was just a lonely teenager's forbidden fantasy. From the first moment I saw you, I knew that not even the colors of our skin could keep us apart. But damn, he's not to something else. Hurry, seaweed. Did you know what I've been missing, Link? I think I do. Trace, they can stop us from kissing, but they can't stop us from singing. Once I was a selfish fool who never understood. Never looked inside myself. Though on the outside, I look good. Then we met and you made me the man I am today. Tracy, I'm in love with you, no matter what you wear, cause without love, life is like the seasons with no summer, without love, life's like rock and roll without a drummer, darling, I'll be yours forever, cause I never want to be without love, so Tracy never set me free, Tracy, I ain't lying, never set me free. Tracy, no, no, no. Once I was a simple girl, then stuff came to me. But I was still a nothing, though a thousand fans may disagree. Fame was just a prison, signing autographs of war. I didn't have a clue till you came banging on my door that without love, life is like my dad without his promo, without, without love. love. Life's just making out to Perry Como Darling, I'll, I'll be yours forever Cause I never wanna be without love So darling, throw away the key I'm yours forever Throw away the key Yeah, yeah, yeah Living in the ghetto Black is everywhere you go but I thought I'd love a girl with skin as white as winter snow. In my ivory tower, life was just a wholesome snack. And now I've tasted chocolate and I'm scared of going back. Cause without love, life is like a bee that you can't follow. Without love, life is no mistake, I'd be a follow. Darling, I'll be yours forever, cause I never wanna be. Without love Oh darling, never set me free 
I'm yours forever Never set me free No, no, no If you're locked up in this prison trace I don't know what I do Link, I've got to break out so that I can get my hands on you Girl, if I can't touch you now, I'm gonna lose control See with you on my black white night above my blue white soul Sweet freedom is our goal Trace, I wanna kiss you And I can't wait for the parole Without love Life is like a problem that won't bite us Without love Life's getting my big break and laryngitis Without love Life is like my mother on a diet Like a week that's only Mondays Only ice cream, never Sundays Like a circle with no center Like a door mark, do not enter Darling, I'll be yours forever Cause I never wanna be without love Without love I surrender happily without love Elsewhere, in local news, teenage TV personality and rebel rouser Tracy Turnblad has escaped from the Baltimore Woman's House of Detention. Authorities believe she may have been aided by the once promising, formerly wholesome teen idol, Link Larkin. Mm -hmm. If cited, citizens are asked to notify police, or, if the phone service is not available, simply shoot to kill. Jesus. In other news, Ava Marie Saint is no saint. Lord have pity. It's a crazy city. Who's at the back door? My baby! Uh, Penny, is it? Yes, ma'am. Seaweed's got a girlfriend. Is it okay that I brought her home and needed to get away from a nasty ass mama? Hush now. Don't explain. I got an inkling and a twinkling first time I seen you two dance together. And you don't mind? I never mind, love. It's a gift from above. But not everyone remembers that. So you two better brace yourselves for a whole lot of ugly coming at you from a never-ending parade of stupid. Oh, it's okay. My mother's gonna kill me anyway. No, she won't. She'll kill him. Hey, hey Miss Motormouth. We broke Tracy out of jail. We know, homie. It's been on all three channels, homie. Breaking out was easy compared to getting a cab to this side of town. Well, we gotta get busy. 
Only 24 hours to lose hairspray. We may never get another chance like this. And this time, we should get Corny and the guards at the studio to help us. Oh, what about your dad? He has sometimes has ideas. And, and I know a guy no. who, uh... I have to turn myself in and go back to jail. Say what? Tracy, no. I don't want to put any of you in any more danger. We should have thought more before we broke out. My father could lose the hardy heart hut and Lincoln. You could go to jail for what you did tonight. Just first base in the back of the cab, I swear. Yeah, homie. Miss Motormouth, we've just been on three channels of news. I don't want you to get arrested for harboring a fugitive. And Penny, your mother will kill you. No, she'll kill him. And anyway, this time it won't be like Parent Child Day. Miss Von Tussle said there'd be armed guards at the Aventorium. Yeah, with arms. Someone could get shot. Say what, homie? No one said anything about someone getting shot, homie. Hold it. Nobody ever said this was going to be easy. If something's worth having, it's worth fighting for. Tracy, why did you start all this in the first place? Was it so you could dance on TV? No. Was it so you could get the boy? No, I almost lost him because of it. Then maybe it was just so you could get yourself famous. No, I just think it's stupid. We can't all dance together. So you tried once and you failed. We can't get lazy when things get crazy. Children, you weren't the first to try, and you won't be the last. But I'm here to tell you that I'm going to keep lining up until someday somebody breaks through. And I've been looking at that door a whole lot longer than you. What door? The front door. There's a light in the darkness, though the night is black as night.
turn the lights to the audience for the first time ever certified up to the WYDT Studios. It's the Corny Contest Race Spectacular. What's you about to watch Esther? What can you tell? How many love to charm? Boys will stay straight. What gets a gal? That's a lunch Getting off in a rocky, then out of space he chilled you. Oh, I took a chance for him to get up and dance with his nice sister's best friend. And tell the mother, her head she should smother. Don't touch me, please. So if you're a redhead, a blonde, a brunette, take my advice and you might just guess.
with a minor in ethnic studies, and I want to be the first to say that the Corny Collins Show is now and forever officially integrated. Yeah. America, look up. Here's history right before your eyes. Television will never be the same. This is marvelous. The phones are going crazy. The whole country's watching. Even the governor called. He said he's enjoying the show so much that he's granted a pardon to Tracy, plus a full scholarship. Well, to the Essex Community College. <laughs> you cannot buy this kind of publicity. Velma, you're a genius. I am. Uh, yes, I am. Ultra Clutch is about to launch an entirely new brand of products. And I want this woman to head the campaign. I just know what to say. It comes with offices, a company car, and a multi-figure salary. I just know what to say. Velma Von Tussel, you are now the newly appointed Vice President of Ultra Glow, beauty products for women of color. I just don't know what to say. <laughs> and America would like to hear you two kids sing our brand new theme song. I actually think I might be able to get your recording contract. My big break. <laughs> what is my daughter? I know you have I saw it on TV. Penny, I hardly recognize you done up like that. Mama. And you look so happy too. I can't say it's what I want, but if this fine looking cat like black boy is responsible for the light in your eyes, then how could I object? <laughs> like television, folks. <laughs> There's nothing like it. Trace, I know this may not be the right moment since we're on national TV and all, but if I don't kiss you now, I may just bust a gut. I wouldn't want you to hurt yourself. Ew! If I get completely sick. Somebody tell me, if she came in through the front door, what the hell's in that town? My masterpiece, Siwi, can you give me a hand? Coming right up, Mr. T. This might be the largest novelty item ever erected. Fire! <laughs> so, what did I miss? I've been in that camp since lunch and well, I wouldn't head in there straight after me if I were you. Mama, we did it. We're on national TV. National television? America, I made this myself. You can't stop my happiness Cause I like the way I am And you just can't stop my nice and soft When I see a Christmas ham So if you don't like the way I look Well, I just don't give a damn The world keeps spinning round and round And my heart keeps trying to speed up sound I was lost till I heard the drums And I found my way You can't stop the thing Oh, oh, stop, yes! Yeah. Be 
Cause I am Miss Baltimore Is it charm? Is it poise? No, it's hairspray! What gets a gal asked out to lunch? Is it brains? Is it dough? No, it's hairspray! It's me! Round and round and my heart's keeping time to speed 
So for the both of them, um, we have some very nice gifts, both of which are vouchers. One is for the v and Water Front, I believe that's going to Mr. Braskovich, and the other one is for a spa, which is for Mr. Richardson. And we have some lovely flowers for the both of them. So can we please give them a huge round of applause? They are the, they are the, the directors. Um, on behalf of Judy and myself, we stand before you tonight extremely proud of the efforts of each of these fine young ladies and gentlemen. And um, it has been a rather long and stressful term. Uh, I don't know what happened, but we found ourselves about two weeks shorter than normal. So we definitely felt it, but due to form, the cast and crew came to this point and made it a reality. So thank you for that. It, it falls upon me to just thank a couple of people here tonight, because without this... And these people, what you saw here tonight, could not have happened. So, you didn't indulge me for a little bit. Uh, the success of this week is a culmination of many hours of work and efforts from a multitude of people. And we would like to take this opportunity to express our heartfelt thanks to them. Firstly, and I know this is going to be a bit difficult, but I think they also need their moment on stage, is the entire backstage crew. So, I'm going to call them up. Taryn Stevens, Joshua Fisher, Michelle De Castro, Stuart Brown. Come on, you guys come take a bow, please. Karen. Stuart. And Josh. Ladies and gentlemen, the backstage crew. Well done, guys. You know, without them, the military precision of ensuring that the right prop is on the stage or that the cast is safely on and off to perform has not always been easy. But you guys have been and have done an amazing job, so thank you. Secondly, to the technical crew, and they are all at the back there, you can't actually see them past the lights, but to Adam Trojan, Amy Wood, Emily Von Lim, and then from Soundworks, we've got Gavin and Jonathan. You guys have played an important role in ensuring that this cast looks and sounds good. So thank you very much to you guys. Judy and I would also like to thank Connor Thompson, although he wasn't behind the sound this year. He was responsible for our electronic booking system. So to Connor Thompson, thank you very much to you. And then I'm not too sure if the cast knew this, but your choreographer was watching you tonight. So I think she's sitting over there somewhere. Miss Anita Sales, thank you for your choreography and making a miracle happen again. It was indeed a miracle. And then, a special word of thanks must go to the many members of the staff who have assisted us in many, many ways. And I hope I haven't forgotten anybody, but I, I do want to mention them. To Miss Karine Peterson, her catering team. To Miss Brinkley and her set design team. Mr. Kendall and Mr. Patrick Sakuza and the building of this magnificent set. The carrying back and forth of equipment. Miss Bianca Blows and Miss Michelle, uh, Michelle Priestman for the handling of the ticket sales and bookings. Grober Stoffberg for taking pictures. And finally, to Helen Davies for the amazing artwork of the poster, the program, and the tickets. It's wonderful to know that we are part of an amazing team. So thank you to all of you. In addition, a special word of thanks must go to our wonderful parents. You guys have indulged us. Uh, you have fetched and carried the cast members to and from every single rehearsal three times a week. You have supported every step of our journey. and You've been here night after night cheering on, helping set up things, washing plates and glasses, and supporting when necessary. In particular, I'd like to single out a few parents for their outstanding work, because without them, we also wouldn't be here tonight. So, firstly, in her absence, to Mrs. Beth Brown for organizing all the wonderful hoodies that the kids are wearing. Thank you to you. Uh, Mrs. Vanessa Bartlett, I think you are here tonight. Yay. Yes, if you'd like to come up, Judy would like to give you something for all the hair and makeup. Thank you very much for that.
Thank you very much, Vanessa. Uh, to Mrs. Lisa Gemmel for helping us find and source props, costumes, just being everywhere we needed her to be. Lisa, if you'd like to come up and please connect something for Judy. And then finally to Mrs. Christine Sadler, she's helped make costumes, coordinate a lot of the dresses, uh, pin one of the girls backstage because her dress broke. I mean, it's just been an amazing, wonderful source of inspiration. Christine, thank you very much. Please come up. And then, on a personal note, I wish to pay homage to my dear partner in crime, Judy. This is actually our sixth show together. We hung the latest poster up on the wall, and it's starting to take up the entire length of the staff room. And uh, there's absolutely no one I would rather work with. Um, you are an inspiration to so many people. Your energy, energy your boundless inspiration is, and talent is something we all admire. It's Ms. Rich. And then finally, to the cast of Hairspray, Stephen King actually said this, he said, directing teenage actors is like juggling jars of nitroglycerine. It's exhilarating and very dangerous. Uh, believe me when I tell you that this statement is very true. Night after night we watch each of you and uh, we are astounded at your remarkable talent. Uh, it has been an incredible journey with you, and it has been tough, and yet it has been an experience that we will not trade for anything. Thank you for making, for making and entertaining us tonight, and allowing us to see the other side of who each of you are. Each of you have brought a wonderful thing to the show. You are the reason why we're all here, and why we do what we do. Congratulations on superb effort and amazing performance. You've done yourselves, your families, and your school proud. The Hairspray cast, guys. that um, Mr. Grant Raskovich has had so many hats on the last two months. You have no idea. I don't know how you did it all and continue to do it all. I also would not have anybody else as a partner in this kind of, in the, in the theater. <laughs> I think we would kill each other if it's anything else. But Grant, you have been absolutely wonderful. Your boundless energy you're, you just always raise the bar. You make everybody the best that they can possibly be at all times. You never stop. You give, give, give of yourself in everything you do. And this is testament to what he does always. You are a marvel. Thank you, Grant. All right, you guys want to hear one more? I can't hear you. Adam, thank you.
see. You can try to stop the life of God, but you know it just can't be. And if they try to stop us, be we all go to the end of the ACP. Cause the world keeps spinning round and round, and my heart keeps it on to see. Oh, sound how it's lost till I heard the drums and I found my way. Yeah.